Coming in live from Aubrey's office, the sun shining in um, oh so perfectly according to our wonderful filmmaker, Carly. Hi everyone, Erin Winnegar, Aubrey Hutchison Real Estate, Keller Williams. As most of us know, buying and selling can be fairly emotional. And while sometimes we need to definitely be logical, sometimes we also have to address our clients' emotional needs um, and meet them where they are before we can progress on to the logistical part of it. My biggest piece of advice for anybody in real estate is to meet your clients where they are at. So make sure that you are listening to them. Make sure that you are validating their feelings. Make sure that you are providing them value. You know, sometimes it's just being there and listening to them. There's value in that. Uh, I think there's value in knowing the market and having that expertise and being able to provide your client numbers, whether it's for investing or purchasing um, or, you know, pricing of where things are and for which neighborhoods, um, you know, pricing even in and around Helena is different and there's different areas in Helena. Um, even pricing is different in our market depending where we're at. So knowing what's being sold, how much for, what's being things are being listed for, how fast it's getting absorbed, meaning how fast is it closing, how fast is it getting under contract. Those are all ways to provide value to a client. And honestly, sometimes it's Venmoing them $10 so they can go get a beer because it's been a long day and they're dealing with things or they're stressed out and it's just a little something extra to um, you know make their day a little brighter and a little better. And just showing that you're there and alongside them um, throughout the transaction. And even after the transaction as well, checking in, you know, how is the new house? How, how is life? How are, uh, how is the move? How are, tra how's traveling going? All those things I, I personally feel um, add value to the transaction and to the client. If you are a person looking for a real estate agent, you know, don't be afraid to interview a few of them. You may have a relationship with somebody already, which is great, but, um, you know, don't be afraid to go beyond that and really find a person that you connect with. It is, uh, communication is huge. Um, you know, even just check-ins, what's going on, having that resource, having um, those times where as a buyer or seller, you're just like, oh my gosh, um, <laughs> you know, what is happening? Um, you know, I just don't understand having an agent that you can call and connect with and really um, get good information or if they don't know the information like being able to find it out or just having somebody to talk to um, and again on the flip side agents you know just really making sure that your uh, client knows what's going on even if nothing is going on just to check in hey how's it going i just how's moving how's packing gosh i know it's so annoying um or hey great you were able to hire somebody to do it that's wonderful um it really solidifies the relationship between an agent and a client which um i feel like a lot of my clients have come to appreciate with me and i know i certainly appreciate um with my clients as well um i think as far as the market going forward, it is really a great time to buy if you're in the position to. Um, I know I personally am looking forward to buying a home uh, myself. And are the interest rates ideal? Are they at the 2.5% that they were uh, last year at this time? No, they are not. But, uh, you know, for me, the value of home ownership far outweighs uh, the high interest rates just don't be afraid. Don't be afraid to ask questions. Get curious. Uh, we have amazing lenders in town that can help you, uh, different loan programs. Um, if you're wondering who they are, give me a call. <laughs> Happy to pass them along. If you haven't bought in the last, I would say even five years, but five to 10 years, um, there's a lot of nuances and things that have changed in buying and selling real estate. And you know, it really is a benefit to anybody to have a professional leading them and showing them the ropes and guiding them along the way. If you are look, someone looking to buy or sell, really 
find an agent, find somebody you can trust, find somebody you connect with. If you are an agent um, who's new, I would say make sure you are that person that uh, is connecting with your sphere and connecting with your clients and you are uh, showing them um, that you care and that you're there to walk through the process with them. Of course, the other key takeaway is to call me and I will help you <laughs> purchase or sell or whatever your real estate need may be. Um, I would love the opportunity to work with you and share with you my expertise and give you firsthand experience of the values that I mentioned earlier uh, to help you with your real estate needs.